been reported this week that more women are delaying motherhood and having children in their 40s. The Office for National Statistics says that this is a growing trend due to more women focusing on their careers for longer and then enjoying a kind of uh, prolonged adolescence before settling down and starting a family. So when we all look back, what do we wish we'd not put off till later? And what are we determined not to leave any later than right now? OK, well, motherhood... Um, yeah, it's the I biggie, have, isn't it's, it? It's the, it's yeah, the big it's the one biggie, because, yeah. um, you know, we're, we're taught that we can have everything, you can have a career and you can pick and choose when you become a mum and all the rest of it. And I thought that was the case and I had Beau when I was 35 and, um, and I just kept ploughing on with my career and then when I was 40-something I decided I wanted to have another child. Uh, and because I'd, Beau had come along very easily, I thought, well, I'll just have another one when I want. Mm. And, yeah. of course, that isn't always the case, is no. it? So, um, so I would definitely say that um, if I was to give Beau advice, I'd say think about it earlier on, you know. I, I, I don't put it on the back burner. Uh, but what's really strange is I'm 40-something, and I'm really, I've got a real sense of getting older now. It's, I don't, it suddenly hit me about a week ago, like... My body doesn't work as well as it used to. And, oh, and don't tell Do you know what I mean? Yeah. It's like because I've been moved out to the country and I live near a field. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, Where are we going with this? Well, no, I, I walk a lot and I find that my body isn't... It lets me down sometimes. And I, So one of the things I'm not going to put off, and I'm going to try and sort it out next week, I've got to do a will. Yeah. I've not done a will. Oh. A will? Yeah, I'm, I'm not going to... Wasn't exactly know. what we were thinking No, but... Of. No, <laughs> <laughs> I know it sounds a bit miserable. No, it's very important you know to get I mean? one sorted out. Yeah, yeah. because I think, I don't know, just suddenly I've got a real sense of my own mortality and, I, and, and it's yeah. quite frightening in one respect, but also it makes me get my house in order so that I can make sure that Bo's all right in the future and take care of that business, you yeah. know, I, which I'm is important. I'm the same as you. I actually um, wished, looking back now, if all things were equal, I could have had children earlier and I could have had more children and, you know, but things ain't like that, are they? Your life goes on and you have to deal with what you deal with at the time. I would say to my daughter, and she's had Ollie, and I would say, you know, have more while she's in her 20s yeah. and do that now yeah. and then you can have your life after that again. You know, you can start again, whereas if you have them th late 30s, late 40s, yeah. you, you, you know, you're kind of crossing over all the time. But I, also I look back and I think, I wish I'd had a mind camera, you know, like in the moments that you just remember, mm. you know, and you take that photograph, because things do go, don't they? And you yeah. kind of forget. I wish I'd had that uh, just but I always moment. say that to the kids, I always say, right, blink and take the picture. Absolutely and blink. And remember it. You know, it, I, I just think I it's that. important to just remember those times. But you know what most important is? What makes your heart beat every day that you wake up? And, and it's my Ollie and my Keely. And I think that, you know, and all my family. And I think you just have to grab those moments... Not, not lull to back in the, in the past. That past no, is gone. It's gone. Mm. Just take everything now and remember that you didn't remember. Yeah. Mm. And have it now and go, let's take this and just be excited about it all. And, and it's lovely all of that. But what you're saying, I say exactly the same to my daughter. Have them young, love. Have them in your yeah. 20s mm. or even earlier. And uh, I'll look after them, don't worry. Yeah. Granny Carol will be there. <laughs> um, but... But you're absolutely right, you know, particularly nowadays, the younger girls have all these pressures to be superwoman. You've got to be the most brilliant, you've got to yeah. be the most beautiful, you've got to be the thinnest, you've got mm. to be the funniest, you've got to have the man with the biggest car and other Ooh, things. Oh, I'm glad you said car. Uh, <laughs> 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 you know, uh, and so on and so forth. So when I was going through all of that, I had to provide, and my mum and I, Jean, yeah. uh, lived <laughs> together. And, um, and so mum and I kind of provided for each other, and then I started providing for mum, and then I had the kids providing for my kids, and there's like extended family and all of that and now I haven't stopped at all mm. I'm 50 later in the year and I just think right I've had enough of that now uh, everybody's looked after everybody's careful now I'm going to do all the adventures that I should have done in my 20s so I'm going wing walking oh, I'm going to learn no. to scuba I'm go going to do uh, learn how to sail I'm going to do so much more traveling than I've ever done before wow. and I'm going to do all of that stuff now before it's too late yeah. no, so that's what I do you see, you see I'm listening to you three, and do you know what? I don't regret one thing, and I don't regret having kids because I'm listening to you when you're saying, oh, I wish I'd have had this, I wish yeah. I'd have done that, I wish I'd have had these earlier, I wish I'd have done that. Because I haven't had kids, I've been able to learn to scuba dive, I've been yeah. parachute jumping, <laughs> and I've done everything that I wanted to do, you know, and I've done it all. And now, 
I can relax and enjoy my life a little bit more. Don't you want to come doing it with me then? No, I'm going to sit in, uh, sit in my garden for a change. With your brassicas? <laughs> yes. With your brassicas? With my brassicas. Oh, do you know, I don't want to do anything. I just yeah. want to sit in my garden and grow my own veg. Yeah. And then, I'm not and... going that far. I'll still nip to the supermarket. <laughs> in your gardens. So I <laughs>